Hello and welcome to Gospel and Spade. Today we are going to briefly examine the Silver Scrolls, which date to around 700 to 600 BC. These scrolls can be found today in the Israel Museum in Jerusalem. These two silver fragments measuring 4 centimetres long were found in 1979 in a tomb just to the southwest of the old city of Jerusalem at the site of Ketef Hinnom or the Shoulder of Hinnom. When they were discovered they had to be painstakingly unrolled so that their contents could be read. Once unrolled, it was found that these small fragments contained portions of the Old Testament, written in ancient Hebrew, from Numbers chapter 6, verse 24 to 26, also known as the Priestly Blessing, from Exodus chapter 20, verse 6, and also from Deuteronomy chapter 5, verse 10, and chapter 7, verse 9. The scrolls also contain the name of God, Jehovah. The importance of these scrolls is that they are the oldest known surviving text from the earliest books of the Hebrew Old Testament. And because they date from before 600 BC, they demonstrate that the books of Exodus, Numbers and Deuteronomy and the name of God Jehovah were in existence before the Babylonian captivity of Judah in the 6th century BC which contradicts the claims of liberal critics of the Bible, who have argued that these books and the name of Jehovah only came into existence after the Babylonian captivity of the Jews. They are also important in that when these inscriptions were compared to the texts found in the later Dead Sea Scrolls and the Masoretic text, they were found to be identical. This shows that the accuracy of the methods used by the Jewish scribes in transmitting the Old Testament down through the centuries was reliable. This demonstrates that we can be confident that the Old Testament that we have today is accurate, reliable and dependable. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to leave a like, comment and subscribe for new content every Friday.